Welcome back to another episode of Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. And guess who's missing again? You sure somebody's not? I don't know. Letting them out. This is what I said. Man, this guy isn't just good. He's so good at scary. If he's doing this alone, that is. Anyway, he said, "Dude, this guy's not just good. He's fucking too good." You know what the mission is? Find the doorknob snake. Yeah, of course. Like always. We'll just go straight there, because why not? We'll just go straight to find Zadornov. This shit's getting absurd. Zadornov's escaped custody again. You have to track him down. Yeah, okay. See, and here's the thing. It, they're getting more and more elaborate, alright? Like, the, the odds that I found him last time are... Insane. Oh my god, it is starting me off here again. Oh my god. Find the doorknob snake. He'll fall asleep eventually. Alright, we're looking for Zadornov and hopefully not getting caught. I am taking all these people because I am making sure he's not here again because... That feels like something that they would do to me. Fulton recovery subject confirmed on board uh. helicopter. He said, uh. Ooh, who's peeing in here, dude? Mama. I didn't like that. I'm just gonna pretend that that didn't happen. Sound good to everyone else? Sweet. Nifty. I'm always so happy whenever they enjoy the ride as much as that guy. Not this one. I was like, how long is Snake gonna watch this man for? I'm I can just imagine on some like Metal Gear Solid shit though, where they no one trick me and put it directly at the beginning. I guess not this time though. Shut the fuck up. Over here snoring. Gotta go through the wall that we see forward forever ago. I think that one actually made it in. See that? This I showed the exact perfect mission so that way you wouldn't be confused why there's a big ass not wall here anymore. It's all planned out. Go to sleep, yes, sir. I can't shoot while I'm down like that, I forgot. I always forget.
Damn, I really thought he might be back here. I was like, I don't trust that son of a bitch. That's as long as you're far enough away, they really don't give a fuck if there's gunshots. They're like, oh, that's forever away. Yeah, it's probably nothing. Yeah, yeah. Let's just ignore that shit. Alright, well, I haven't seen him here. Fulton recovery helicopter is complete. Although, believe me, I am fucking looking. I'm just saying, by the way, if I was him at this point, if I had been captured so many times again, I would eventually start, like, knocking someone out and, like, changing clothes. Obviously, the brown trench coat not working in my favor. All right, there's a few places I could, oh, I, I already found, no way, that's a ration. I was like, I already found his ass, Never mind. About to be like, there's a lot of places you could be here. And then I was thought I already found him. Right in the booty hole. That's bad. That's a lot of them. This went south very quickly. I got very, very scared very, very fast. Probably up in those ruins over there. I don't know. Actually, I don't, I'm not going to lie. I don't know where the fuck he is. He's got rockets. Dude's got fucking rockets. Of course I'm gonna kidnap him. Gotta be real though, they're making it incredibly hard to look for this man right now. Take a fucking nap, dude. This is HQ. Good God, the man could swim his way out of Alcatraz. Understood. The enemy should still be nearby. Find him. For real, though, I don't know where the hell he is. Say, so, good God, the man could swim his way out of Alcatraz. Yeah, no, you're 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 not fucking kidding, man. I really I I don't know where the fuck he is either.
probably in there somewhere just to make my life a pain. This is HQ. This is patrol. All clear. Understood. Stay vigilant. An intruder? Can't be imagining things. So casual. Don't mind me, just a casual tank. You know what I mean? Don't mind me, I'm a casual tank. I came by. They didn't even see my ass. Yes, that's it. Yes, 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 yes. Go out searching. Rise and shine. How the fuck they found me? All hostels. Also, who the fuck are you people? Who do you work for? I swear I'm not. I'm so fucking scared. I don't know where this motherfucker is, by the way. They don't know shit. They don't know shit. They don't know shit. Abandon this. Just go back. Thank God. Gave him the old slipperoony. Oh shit, the timer's going down fast as well this time. Shows how much they know. Well, I went in both the buildings. Oh, shit, I didn't go in there. Don't wait. Let's go. Can't be imagining things. We well, must have, buddy, because there's no one here. All right. Only one last place to go check out the crater base. Crater base. What's happening here? Guys, I'm inside the facility. There's rows and rows of trucks here. Zadornov should be somewhere in that area. Find him. He was too hidden here.
Oh my god. Oh my god. It's <laughs> it's it's it. It's Hideo Kojima himself. Damn it. You found me. I found two people. Did I take Mr. Kojima with me? Did I, <laughs> what just happened? I didn't even know that you could I thought that I missed that. Oh, that's incredible. Must have been because yeah, no, because I wait. I got that prisoner. Close, but no cigar. Not for you anyway. Snake, we're coming to pick him up. You do that. Session six from Eva. The course deviation caused the capsule to miss its splashdown. I decided to listen to these because there's not really like a whole lot of plot happening outside of like, oh, he ran away. So now you can hear about the boss. To sink like a stone. The boss used the last of her strength to escape to the surface. Her body was covered in bruises and scorched by radiation. It was a miracle she was still alive. She slipped into a coma and didn't regain consciousness for six months. To some, what was worst of all was that she had lost the space. Damn, to so she straight up. Like, crashed into the fucking ocean, swam all the way back up, and then, like, they still hated her ass? She went, imagine, like, passing out for six months of your life, and just, like, everything had moved on for, like, six months. My god. I think about, like, my YouTube subscriptions, like, how, like my feed, like, all the videos I'd miss, I'd come back, and I'd be like, whoa, they did that? The crazy shit be terrifying now who got canceled for what now holy cow that's incredible the coup sorry de was the soviet propaganda campaign that kicked into gear after the flight the earth was blue those were the words of gagarin on his return and the whole world was listening oh wow the blink of an eye gagarin was an international celebrity earning accolades from every corner it was a PR coup for the Soviet Union. Meanwhile, Washington could only grit its teeth in silence. They decided there was no value in making the boss's flight public, that it would only make matters worse. What? So they buried it instead, labeling it a dark... She really just got, like, the shitty end of the Never stick at the every... Everything in their power to erase... ...chance possible. Like, that's so fucked murder. up, all of it. I still haven't seen that photo. I don't know what the fuck she's talking about with that. that she ever existed. And that wasn't the end of it. As an alibi, the military claimed she'd taken part in the CIA's botched Bay of Pigs plot to take back Cuba. And when the boss was finally well enough to return to service... She was, like, knocked out for six months. She was forced to go underground. What? In the public eye, the boss was still a hero of World War II. In reality, though, she was anything but that. She was a non-person, fit only for the blackest of black ops. In effect, she may as well have been dead. Jesus. Gagarin went on a worldwide tour in front of millions of adoring fans. The boss, meanwhile, was a walking secret, unable to breathe a word about her experience. The authorities in Washington had this to say. Why are you still here? <laughs> if only you'd had the decency to give us a nice quote like Gagarin and then die an honorable death, you'd have gone down as a hero. Oh my god, Three they just literally later, want her to die. Shepard, one of the Mercury 7, made his own ballistic flight. They sure didn't try to cover up his achievement. Oof. He owed his success to the lessons learned from the boss's tragedy before sending Gagarin up into space. The Soviets had used a mannequin called Ivan Ivanovich to test the landing procedure. Which would make the boss America's version of a crash test dummy. But she didn't care. I'm happy to be the dummy, she said. 
if it'll help the project succeed. Nothing would give See that? That's fucking... That's brainwash. Wasn't the end of it. That is straight up brainwash. You can't convince me otherwise. That's straight up brainwash. Or, or the anti-Moscow philosophers have been turned. Either way, it was a situation their American counterparts couldn't stand. To preserve the philosopher's good name, and to repay her debt, so to speak. The boss once again made her way into the Soviet Union. There, she found herself face to face with the Soviet's own agent. Oh my god. A fucking nightmare. Snake, the doorknob's done it again. Oh my god, I'm killing Prince. him this time. Snake, the doorknob's done it again. Ah, give me a break. Snake, listen, the doorknob's done it again. Come on. I hate to entertain the thought, but this might be an inside job. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, no shit, huh? No clue. Can't imagine he's just out to annoy us, though. You know. It might not be worth keeping him here if he's not going to join us. You may be right. I thought it might boost our Russian compatriots' morale, but okay, I'll think it over. Let's hope he's just playing hide and seek. I've added a new mission. I doubt it. Judging by how upset he always is when we find him. Let's go find Zadornov then. If that's what you really want out of all this. Snake, Zadornov's escaped. Yeah, I know. I heard. I'll find him. You believe me. I'll fucking find him. Again. And again. And again and again and again and again. And again. And again. Oh. So he's like actually gotta be somewhere here. Badass. And bring him back here with Fulton recovery. Huh. I'll fall asleep. Yep, there it goes. Damn, I was like certain. I was like, watch his ass be over here. Somebody there. Boo! The enemy's here. Where? Oh, he's fainted. You son of a bitch. Try using Fulton recovery on him. He hid in a box. That's my thing. That one was super short. Super, super short. We'll pick you up there. That one was mad short. Way easier than the other ones. Cake, right? He hid in the heart box. Of course it was, it was, it's bright pink. What do you mean, man? Dun 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 dun. Alright, what happened Guys, now? I've located Zadornov. For the eighteenth time. I knew you would. How could I be so stupid? Uh. He said.
Uh, this man. I swear. I'm gonna go to Mission Select because I want to go fucking listen to that. I want to listen to the 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 finale, the finale, the finish of the boss's story. Let's get this. All right, let's find out what happened to the boss at the end. At the end of everything. Who? It was her former comrade in arms. The father of her child. The man known as the Sorrow. The Sorrow? No, it was the boss who is her. Or to be more precise, Brian's the dad? philosophers never told him. Former lovers. Forced to fight. To the death. One would live and one oh would die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Philosophers had in store for me. I didn't know she had a baby like that. Their child would suffer in their place. They were left with no other option. The boss shot him. He offered no resistance. When she returned from the Soviet Union, there was no place left for her to go. That's why the boss killed the sorrow, even though they loved each other, was because because she had a kid and in return they treated her and one of them had to die or they'd kill them both that's so fucked she was made a scapegoat for no good reason that's so fucked i didn't know that only because power had changed hands in washington any lesser being would have long since cracked it was then that one of her old sas comrades reached out to her major zero and so Fox was born. She undertook a mission that, well, you should know better than anybody. You are a part of it. Oh my God. Twenty days after Shepard's flight, President she Kennedy was like the initial cog and Peace Walker. Or not Peace Walker, <laughs> Snake Eater. America's space program would never have caught up. Armstrong and Aldrin might never have walked on the moon. But the Americans' gain had cost the boss her health, her honor, and the man she loved. The word tragedy doesn't even begin to describe what she endured. The Soviets continued their manned space flights, and in 19... This lady had the saddest fucking life imaginable. And it's crazy that she's realistically only a character in... One Metal Gear game? Snake is the mission that kept her away from you for so long. Now, I know what you're thinking. What am I thinking? Why not use me as her agent? She knew I'd never even think of betraying her. I think it's because she didn't want to drag you into it. She probably knew what was going to happen. To complete the mission, she'd have to turn to the philosophers. And once she knew that I was going to come in there and kick her ass? It, there'd be a price to pay. No one understood that better than her. So please, Snake, let it go. When she gave me the photo, she left me to decide whether or not to pass it along to you. I know she was torn about it. Just as I was. She knew you'd probably blame yourself. I don't blame myself for shit. Hold on to it for so long that I, I can't say. Okay, I blame myself a little. Snake is a little hurty on the inside, I won't lie. Can't lie. She wasn't that kind of person. No. I think she meant it to be a message to you. She had her identity, her life taken away but she wanted you of all people to know the truth snake you've probably already figured this out but it 
It's no accident that I'm only now sending you something I've withheld for so long. A little bird tells me you recently made a big decision. You and the boss are different people. I understand that. And I'm not trying to second guess you. I... I simply wanted you to know what she saw. How she felt. That's all. Keep it with you, Snake. Keep it deep inside. Don't call me anymore, ma'am. We're divorced. You stole the philosopher's key from me. Made me look like a fool. Wait, what? 